Hi, I am Ram Gopal from PresentationProcess.com. In this video, you will learn a PowerPoint movie magic that is sure to impress your audience. This is a combination of video and text animation in PowerPoint. First, let me show you the video clip that we are going to use for this effect. This is the clip. As you can see, it's a very short clip that shows the movement of someone going in the car. There is rain and therefore wiper wipes across the windshield. Just observe. So here is the scene and there is the wiper moving across the windshield. Now what we are going to do is we are going to use the same scene to present two different text elements. There will be a text before the wipe and then when the wiper comes and moves across the windshield there will be a change of text. Take a look at the effect now. This is the scene before wipe and you can see that the wiper is wiping across the text to reveal a new text. Once you understand the basic technique, then you can use a longer video loop with multiple wipes across the windshield to change the text the way you want. For example, take a look at this particular video here. This is a much longer loop. This is text number one and there the wiper um, changes it to text number two and after a while text number three is revealed after removing two and after a while three would get wiped off and then four would get revealed and after some time four would get removed and five would get revealed. Can you see here there is a lot of very useful applications for something like this. Let us learn how I created this useful effect from scratch. Here we start with three basic components. The first one is this video loop which is a very short one which has the effect of a wiper wiping across the windshield. Then we have two text elements, one that says text before wipe and the second one which says text after wipe. Of course, you can change this text with anything else of your choice. The first thing we are going to do is to select the video loop, go to the playback option in the PowerPoint ribbon, then go to the option called start automatically. Beautiful. The first bit is done. Next, we need to add a bookmark for this video. We need to find the exact spot after which the wiper moves across the windshield. So let us play the video clip. Yeah, somewhere around here, the wiper seems to be moving across. So I'm going to manually move this and see that it is, uh, we are going to have a bookmark just before that. Say somewhere, yeah, somewhere around here. Okay, so somewhere around here, we will have the bookmark happening. So you can see that it is almost about to wipe and that is where we are going to have it. And let us say add bookmark in the playback option. So I'm going to say add bookmark. Then I'm going to have this bit removed. We don't really require this where it says when you click, it'll pause. So we don't really require that. I'm going to say delete. Then I'm going to have two animations happening. The first one is text before wipe. Now there is no entrance animation to this. We are going to leave this on the slide first. Then I'm going to add an animation called exit animation and it is an exit wipe animation and it is part of the exit uh, options here. So let us go to wipe and then let us change the effect options from right. So that is how the text gets wiped out. Then we are going to have this one enter the scene, which is text after wipe after previous. So let us go to the wipe option here and then say from left. So this is going to be after wipe. Now I'm going to have this happen after previous, but then for a bit of drama, I'm going to add a slight delay of say 0.25 seconds so that after the wiper goes entirely here, then this text gets revealed. So that is what we are going to do here. So we have got two animations, one that wipes this out, another one that wipes this in with a delay of 0.25 seconds. Let us go to this exit animation and let us go to the animations tab and we are going to add a trigger. So we are going to click on the trigger option and then we are going to say on bookmark 
and this animation needs to be triggered on bookmark number one. So that is what is the point because the bookmark that we have done here is given the name called bookmark one and we want the animation to be triggered exactly at that point. Then we are going to move this entrance animation of text after wipe right after the previous one of course with 0.25 delay like the way that we had planned earlier and then we are going to select both the elements and then i am going to ensure that they are both aligned properly so let us go to arrange align and say align center arrange align and say align middle and now when i go to the slideshow mode you can see that the movie plays automatically that is the video clip plays automatically and just as the playhead comes to that particular bookmark this animation gets triggered which is the text one gets wiped out and right after that text two gets revealed with a 0.25 seconds delay take a look at this let us go to the slideshow mode the video plays and then the wiper comes and then removes the old text and brings in the new text so that is how this effect plays as you can see it's a very simple thing it is just a matter of exiting one and entering another animation and that happens at the trigger of a certain bookmark which we have planned earlier once you understand how to do this you can replace this video with a much longer clip with multiple wipes and of course you can always set up multiple text elements one after another so that they are all triggered based on different bookmarks along the video clip now what i've shown you is just a small inspiration you can apply the same technique for different events that happen in the video so that your text comes and exits at the precise points i hope you really liked that simple yet very powerful technique of combining video with text animation if you want to learn more such creative techniques then i highly recommend that you join the course called ram gopal's powerpoint mastery program it is arguably the most comprehensive and creative powerpoint training that teaches you tons of such useful creative powerpoint tips and tricks that you can use in your presentations to impress your audience i will leave a link to ram gopal's powerpoint mastery program in the description box below the video you can click on the link and know more about this useful product Finally, if you want to receive exclusive PowerPoint tips and tricks that I share only with my email subscribers, please join our newsletter called Success by PowerPoint by clicking on the link here. You will get simple and useful PowerPoint tips that you can use right away in your presentations. Please click on the link, join the newsletter and I'll see you inside. Thank you.